Hello and welcome to Shared Library. Today we'll be going over the data resource Statista. Statista primarily contains market and consumer data, but it can be used to find information for a variety of disciplines. There are multiple ways to get to Statista via the library website. You can find it under S for Statista under the A to Z database list by clicking on Databases and Browse All Databases. To locate Statista and other data sources, it's quickest to use the Research Methods and Data Sources page. First, go to Research, then Locate Data Sources under the Find section. You will then scroll down for Statista. To access this resource, you'll be required to input your ETSU credentials, as with other library resources. After a successful login, you will find East Tennessee State University at the top left of the page. The main tabs covered today will be Statistics, Reports, Outlooks, and Infographics. Statistics cover a broad range of topics, mostly relating to consumer trends. However, they have a narrow focus. Reports are the culmination of a number of statistics and other information, organized to provide an overview on a particular topic. Outlooks feature projections based on current statistics and industry trends. Infographics are Statista's created resources which provide a visually appealing way to communicate the information found via these other resources. There are several ways to find what you need on Statista. Current popular topics will be listed under the search bar. For example, let's explore information on the film industry. On your left, you'll find the subject breakdown. For this topic, we're under Media, TV, Video, and Film. You are given an overview of the topic with subject-specific headings. You'll also find leading market location, revenue, and other information relating to top performers in the industry. By scrolling down, you will find relevant statistics in the center, and to the right you will find relevant topics, infographics if available, reports, and other items relating to the film industry or another topic you've chosen. This may include information from private research companies, government data, or Statista itself. Let's look at one of these statistics. Under diversity, I'm going to choose gender distribution of film directors in the U.S. 2011 to 2019. Please note that there is a green plus sign next to the statistic. This is to indicate that it is premium content, which you should have access to if you are logged into Statista via Shared Library. Now we'll click on the title and the statistic will load. You can right click to open as a new tab or in the same tab, whichever you prefer. This is the general view for statistics. To the right, you will find citation information, including the source. This particular data set comes from a Hollywood diversity report conducted by experts at the University of California. One particularly helpful aspect of Statista is that it provides graphs and data visualization options such as infographics for you. By scrolling down, you'll find other related statistics. Now we use the search function to find a report in Industry Outlook. We can get to this by either clicking on Statista or in the search bar. An important note about Statista is that unlike some of our other databases, it responds best to as few keywords as possible to get your topic across. For this search, I'm going to type Social Media Influencer. As I type, you will notice that it's providing suggestions. Feel free to use these as well. Now we'll hit Search. or the Enter key. The results and filter options are located on the left, similar to our other databases. Let's filter to forecasts and surveys, studies and reports, and expert tools, which often contain broader outlooks. Scrolling down will also filter for high accuracy, and then refresh search. If you choose Reset Filters, it will remove your preferences and search for the default options. 
We have a number of options here from dossiers to industry reports and other statistics. Let's look at the Social Media Advertising Digital Markets Report. At the top of each of these reports, you will find highlights, the definition of the market you're studying, the scope of the project, and related reports. To the right, you will find options to download and cite this information. Always be sure to double check your citations using Purdue OWL or a style manual. Scrolling down, you will find market indicators and spending information. Let's take a look at the report at the top of the page. Similar to the digital market projections, this report includes the scope of the project, download and citation options. You will also find recommended studies and statistics based on this report. Finally, we will look at infographics. To access these, I am going to scroll to the top of the page and click infographics. However, you can also find them via Statista's general search or in related fields as indicated earlier in the video. The search method is the best option for finding specific infographics. Statista has a daily release schedule which you can find on this page. Infographics are usually related to current events. For example, here is one on COVID-19 vaccination rates by state. After clicking on an infographic title or image, you will be met with an overview of the information, the Statista employee responsible for creating the data visualization, and citation information. Data source information should be located on the bottom of the infographic itself. As with other aspects of Statista, related infographics can be found at the bottom of the page. Statista also allows for social media sharing and embedding as needed. Those are the basics of how to find information on Statista. Thank you for watching. If you need any further assistance, please set up a research help appointment.